is very late right now. I believe the last time I checked the clock, it was 2.57 a.m., which is not good since I have to wake up in five hours from now. If I go to bed at three, which is not going to happen realistically, four, five, six, seven, eight, I need to be at the venue at nine o'clock. So I need to get up at eight so I can shower, prepare myself for the day's chores. Tomorrow I am helping co-sponsor, um, co-sponsor may be too much to say, but I am um, going to help the, uh, the person who is bringing Jimmy Eat World and Paramore live in concert tomorrow to my area. So I have a full day tomorrow uh, running, doing things for the band, helping set up the stage, um, basically whatever I'm told. If the band's like, I need a bottle of Jack Daniels right now, I jump in the truck and I run and I go get whatever they want. So I'm supposed to be at the venue tomorrow at 9. It's... It's way too late. I'm not going to have any sleep. Um, tomorrow will be an interesting day. I'm going to see if I can get some footage of tomorrow. I just, I had to make a vlog tonight. This might be a little bit longer. I'm going to stop saying it's going to be longer to get to the point. I'm not going to edit this. There's no editing involved. I'm just going to talk about what I want to say. This is a true vlog. No funniness, no skits, no hot wives, no cute kids, no big dogs, nothing but me. That's what you got. So, I just got off the phone with my bud, your uh, celebrity, SXE Phil. We talked for an hour and a half, and that makes me feel good inside. Right here. It's soft. It's soft and warm. No sexual comments below. However, he is a good guy. We just talked, and um, he's in the New York Times. Is that good? Have you guys ever heard of that magazine? Yeah, it's a little publication they produce um, in, in a state called New York, the New York Times. I'm going to leave a link. A link? I'm going to leave a link in the sidebar on the left over here if I can find it. If I can't, that means I'm an idiot and I'm sleep deprived. I'm going to try to find the link and I'll leave it over here. Sexy Phil is in the New York Times. That is amazing. Not only because he's amazing, but he's a YouTuber and we're all YouTubers. So that's cool that one of us got in the New York Times. However, notwithstanding and nonetheless, what I really want to talk about this evening is the fact that there are haters out there. And not necessarily haters, but just, I mean, what's a hater? If you get down to the dictionary term, if you look up in Webster's and you say hater under H, what's a hater? Who's a hater? Is it somebody that's just having fun and just typing dirty, mean comments just because they're bored, they're jealous, they have no life, they, <laughs> they want to swear and tell you you're stupid? And I'm not talking about my haters. Everybody has haters. Everybody on YouTube can get a negative comment from anybody. But what I'm talking about is us. As a YouTube community, are we not all haters ourselves? And you may say, Shay. I'm not a hater, but what I'm specifically talking about is the new YouTube interface that is is upon us. It's not upon us, but <laughs> basically the new YouTube look when we're watching videos. I have not heard, I don't think I've heard any positive comments on the new YouTube interface. And I don't know what interface means, but I've been told by It's Brent, link on the sidebar, I gotta leave a lot of links now, that it means the new YouTube look. You know, there's videos, there's things you can click on, you can send your videos to people, you can forward your videos to people in Iraq, you can um, get a video and fold it up and put it in your pocket. I'm making this up as I go, that's not true. What I'm purposely wanting to talk about right now, I really should not have said that I'm not going to edit this video because I should need to edit now. Aren't we all haters of the actual YouTube.com website because we don't like what they've done? Don't we always complain about the YouTube messaging system? Don't we always say, YouTube, you, we need to get Gmail. The comments never line up to the replies. What are you doing, YouTube? You suck. Fix your problems. You're losing it. I'm unsubscribing. I'm taking my account down. Isn't that what we are? Are we not all haters? Don't we, as a YouTube community, need to look in the mirror and see that we ourselves are haters to the very website that gives us hours and hours of enjoyment? Is that not true? I'm done.
It's probably 3 a.m. now. I, uh, at, at, in some way, shape, form, or fashion, have to help a major concert go on tomorrow. Uh, in about five hours from now, I have to help set up the stage and do whatever I will. So I am done uh, vlogging. I'm going to go ahead and push the button and say goodbye. I want you to think about that. Are we all haters? Can't we just enjoy what other people try to provide? Like YouTube? I love you, YouTube. Feature this video!